So components in Figma are a great way to standardize your designs and enables you to prepare a template for an object that then can be reused across project or across many projects. Sometimes though you need to make certain modifications that these components from their very nature don't allow you to do. In fact, component instances don't let you modify like almost anything. And sometimes you simply have to ungroup the component, which is called detaching a co component, and this will remove the connection between the instance and the main component. So to demonstrate this, we actually have to create a component first. So I'm gonna create a very simple component. It's gonna be a button. So now we have a button component and we have a button instance. If we want to add or remove elements from the component, it's not possible. It's uh, only possible to hide elements. So if I select the text within the, comp within the instance and then hit delete, you can see that it appears to have disappeared, but actually it's just being hidden. If I want to paste an element inside the button, it's just not, that's just not possible. And so you might need to detach a component. And to do that, you select the instance, go here to the design panel and go to instance options and then detach instance. You can also press command option B or control alt B if you're on Windows. So I'm gonna press command option B and you can see that it changed from being purple to being regular blue when you're dealing with basic regular objects. And so right now I can do any changes I want. It's just any other element. Now, this might be obvious, but it's very good to remember that when you actually detach an instance, any changes you do in the component will not be carried through onto the quote unquote instance. This is not an instance anymore. It's a completely different object. So don't expect to make changes to this, this object through making changes here. If we didn't detach the instance, this would be the behavior you'd see. If you change anything here, that would update on all instances. And um, that's not the case with our detached instance. So that's how you detach a component, how you detach an instance. Usually you probably should not be doing that because especially when working in design teams, components are there to standardize, they are there to establish design systems. And if you detach a component, you can then, you know, break this consistency. But of course, sometimes it's necessary. So if this video was useful to you, I'd appreciate you leaving a like. And if you're interested in learning Figma, definitely go and check out my channel where I do tutorials on Figma, UX and UI design. Thank you, and I will see you in the next one.